to Mike Herbert's playfavorites.com and uh, something a little bit different there I think a bit of Spanish playing um, very easy to play actually um, it looks good, sounds good and uh, it doesn't take you too long to learn let's get in tune first of all it's in conventional tuning, standard tuning so just follow my tuning, 6th string <laughs> 5th string Fourth string, third, second, and first. Okay, I know some of you struggle with tuning, but uh, just practice, just keep at it. Get some pitch pipes or an electronic tuner, and it just comes with practice, no problem. So let's talk you through this piece. The chords you're going to need to know are A minor, and E, which is the same shape, but you need easier, so it's mostly. We also use an F shape. We're not going to use the full F. We're going to use this reduced reduce version, this cut-down version. And if we... If you're going to do the strumming bit at the end, you'd also need the G. Other than that, it's just uh, a few picks. So let's talk you slowly through it. Start with an A minor. We do one pull down, one um, rush down on the strings, and then a pick on the first string. So it's open, third, first, open. So, strum, open. Move to E, and do exactly the same, and then do the same run on the second string. F shape, and then we start this long run which starts on the second string. I'll do it slowly for you. Open first, and then move our E chord up one fret, and then down to its normal position. So the whole of that sounds like this. Then our picking piece, uh, the picking section, we hold down the first fret on the third string, second fret, fourth string, and we're going to pick um, the notes in this order, the fourth, third, second. But in between each of those notes, we're going to pick up on the first string. We do that twice, and then we move down one fret and start our pick on the third string, same pattern. to the beginning. And then up to our E shape slid forward one fret. So the whole piece goes like this. shape slid forward one fret
If you want to try the strum I showed you at the beginning, it goes like this. It's slightly advanced, but you never know, you might give it a try. Um, we're going to hold an E chord, a G chord, an F chord, an E chord, and then they move up E, and then back down again. And the strum goes like this. It's down with the first finger, followed by the thumb, and then an upstroke with the first finger. So together that sounds like this. I'll do it slowly. And then it just immediately repeats. The third time we do a down and up. So it's... to a G and an F and an E and slide the E and back again and we can do all sorts of variations so we get that sort of flamenco strumming sound it looks very impressive but it does take some practice to get this bit right so down, down in Mexico couldn't we okay go and practice and um, if you need any help with it um, pester me email me mike at playfavorites.com I'm sure that some of you will many of you do and I do enjoy getting your emails so um, don't worry about pestering me <laughs>